all right ladies and gentlemen what's up what's good with y'all we are here with another video and yeah we're back with more my rise for 2k24 and what happened last time? oh yeah you got xavier which show canceled which sucks and <laughs> i don't know what else to tell y'all about that it's, it happens but anyway this episode we're not gonna cover any we're not gonna do any of this stuff with troy yet quite quite yet we should do side stuff and then yeah jump back to the main story stuff but anyway let's see what melanie wants or whatever Down up, down up. Looks like it's been tailored by a right handed tornado using left handed scissors. Like he can talk. Remember his suit this time about a year ago? Embarrassing. Anyway, I was wondering if you're going to fire back at MVP or just take your thoughts directly uh, to him in the form of a backstage. Mm. You could teach MVP a lesson in style and make a fashion statement he'll never forget. Yeah, why not? It's taking on MVP in the backstage brawl, which won't hurt none, honestly. They're take on the. In a in a suit, bro. Bro, why am I fighting this man MVP in a fucking suit, bro? All right. Let me get away from this man. Just going here. Yeah, that was easy. Up the ladder he goes. All right. Now let's get away from this man to get up here. Because, of course, the computer takes eons just to climb up a freaking ladder. Not sure if he's trying to escape or take this fight into a new and dangerous direction. Separation. Oh God, that really might have just fell on someone. This has to stop. Holy hell, somebody get them out of there. They're going to fall over for heaven's sake. to neutralize that arm and remember guys this is a loading dock area this isn't built with any safety precautions in mind say what you mean cole no one's supposed to be up there oh one wrong step at that height. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. how far is too far Smartest decision <laughs> did, the, did the man mvp just turn into a whole fucking helicopter bro Damn. Well, he he he's probably broken in half by now. Vicious right forearm. Vicious downright savage club right there. Ujiwar armbar. Yeah. I'm surprised. I'm surprised that no like staff or any managers and stuff came out and was like, "Hey, stop! Get it out! Get, get him off! Get him off! Get him off!" Oh no! One of the most dreaded maneuvers. Vertebra breaker. Alright. Um, am I gonna be able to get my fucking whatchamacallit? Situational awareness with a knee to the abdomen. He reverses it. Oh, that'll clean your clock. To the throat. Nasty. All right. Nope. And he reversed it. Fuck, dude. Yo. Hey, w w this this whole thing backstage, bro. See, I don't get how he is not knocked out yet. I need to find like some kind of weapon. 
He knew that was coming. That's one thing I don't understand is like how they can like just bro. Bro. I don't know who he's trying to take me to. Alright. Let's, let's just go ahead and end this. End this. End this. End this. It's GG's. End this. Nope. And he fucking reversed it, dude. Okay. Okay. MVP is ready. Has him in the danger zone. Dodges. Yeah. Oh my, they just shattered the glass window. Yeah. All right. Like they're done. Okay. Jeez Louise. That was that was fucking lengthy as fucking shit, dude. For no reason. Jeez. Oh. Okay. I mean, oh, that was that was easy. I thought that was gonna be longer than that. All right. Well, time to um, I guess move on. See this stuff with Troy. Sam, I am so excited you're here. Troy, All right. Would you take offense if I said that every time you're this excited, I worry something bad is going to happen? Oh, not this time. Miz has the most must-see, vertically integrated, synergistic, incredible stunt in the history of SmackDown planned, and you are the star attraction, huh? The suspense is killing me. Or maybe that's just your breath. <laughs> I'm, I'm on my Damn. way. Damn. I'm telling you, you're going to love this. Love it. Love is in the air. Hello. Okay, so tuxedo. All right. All right. I don't want to confirm the story quite yet, because I, I think yeah, there's nothing. Yeah, there's nothing else because once once I progress through, that's it. I there's no going backwards. Oh, I think I'm almost done. Where have you been? Okay, I guess it's time to find out. Oh man. All right. Well, yeah. Let's just let's go ahead and do this. Story gate. You're about to enter story gate. Playing the playing will advance the story, and you're unable to return play any optional storylines you may have not completed. What optional things have I not done? There's got to be some stuff that I've not done yet. So let's let's re double check. Just make sure story progress. Um, imposter syndrome. Land opening championship celebration. Um. Challenge. Okay, so there's this control alt defeat cross challenge. Huh. All right, let's let's just progress. Let's just see what this is about. Let's just keep going. All right. Okay. Let's just keep going. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. It's a little bit, but I just want to make sure there's nothing that I missed. If there's stuff that I missed, cool. It sucks. Uh Whatever. All right, let's see what this. Where th have you been? Sorry. All right. Finally, we can talk about my plan to make you the brightest light on the road to WrestleMania. Wait, we're already on the road to WrestleMania. What? Your can be explained away by dressing the announcement of who I'm defending against at Mania. Think bigger. We are going to do a WWE classic, a wedding. Wait. Who exactly is getting married? Oh, it's as bad as you're thinking. If by bad you mean brilliant, guys, the WWE Universe loves the chemistry between the attractively toxic GG Dolan and the most must-see Universal Champion in WWE. Uh, I'm the only Universal Champion in WWE? Yep. When you went and trained with Lita, it gave me the inspiration. When she and Kane got married, that was must see. Oh my what god. The point is, 
the marriage of Gigi Dolan and the WWE Universal Champion will draw more eyeballs than a royal wedding. Take that, Regal. Where the fuck is War Games, bro? Did they skip War Games? Bro, I'm pissed. A lot of questions. Yes, aim. I have all the answers, but right now, you guys have to get dressed. Uh. Dressed for. We are announcing your big engagement with a Miz match challenge. Gigi and the Dark Horse versus the hottest couple in WWE history, Miz and Mrs. But we didn't get engaged. Bro. Yeah, I have concerns. Lay them aside and put on your formal wear, because we've got an engagement to announce. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, this. Yep. Uh, that's WWE for you. They come up with the most outlandish things and out-of-pocket things. I'm up with at all whatsoever. <sighs> so you mean to tell me I'm fighting Miz? In okay, <laughs> what in the world? This is just like the fan fiction I wrote. Uh, what in the world, bro? And their opponents, Gigi Dolan and Jay Williams, the most the forgotten man who is now etched in the annals of WWE history. This is inspiration. Okay. Sure, but he better be careful. In a in tux, bro. Why? Becomes overrated. It usually doesn't end well for him. This is. Everyone looks for this engagement match. This just makes zero sense. Whatever. I'm just... According to my notes, our GM is actually calling this a Miz match challenge. Okay. Not surprised as the Miz will do anything for publicity, but to exploit yeah, someone to... else's engagement is a bit much. Bro. Congrats to the champ and Gigi. <laughs> Don't spoil the party, Saxton. He's been placed in the corner now. <clears throat> Okay. Okay. Double suplexes. Nice, nice, nice. Bro, why, why are they still fighting? Ooh. Left by the turnbuckle. All right, that's number two. Ooh, nice clothesline by me. All right, come on, suplex. Oh no, DDT. One. A kick out, and you can All see right. the frustration starting to build. Channeling his energy to stay in this matchup. Uh oh. Half and half suplex. Lights up. Underhook applied. Side effect. And that was not the kind of treatment for an A lister getting knocked down a peg or two. Yeah. Jeez. 
Oh, never mind. Uppercut. Clean. Ooh. Nice moonsault by me. Bro, why did the ref get in the way? Why does the ref be getting in the way, bro? <clears throat> the ref be picking the worst times to be getting in the way. Okay, come on. That's GG's. That is GG's. Yeah, Miz can't do anything. Can I hit my signature, please? Come on. Come on, no. Whatever. Whatever. Could have just been a tease of the potential agony that's yet to come. Oh, come on. Just take a chill pill. Just right. Just, just, just take it easy. <coughs> Reese ain't getting up, bro. She's got her. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. She's getting up. She's getting up. She's getting up. She's getting up. Oh, she's up. Is she not going to get in the ring? I'm just going to sit here and taunt until she gets in the ring. Because that's just annoying. I'm just taunt. I'm going to just... Finally. And that is... Dunzo. Never mind. to the fucking Miz and Maurice, which is bullshit. <clears throat> okay. Uh, also, my camera froze at the worst time. Gigi, what are you doing? I'm not supposed to see you before the ceremony. Well, shoot. I guess if watching me beat up Maurice in this beautiful dress didn't jinx our wedding, this definitely put a nail in the mirror. What is actually happening? I don't know, but I've signed some stuff too. You don't think I it's... wouldn't put anything? Well, all right, I got gross. Okay, well let's see how this goes, bro. I was not expecting to get eat by Miss. Uh, I don't like <laughs> Roman. 
come back, brother, so I can face you one on one. I could have sworn Miz promised us a spectacular wedding for the ages. Not sure this is that. Stop, Saxton. I have been assured the bride and groom wanted an intimate service on live television. I'm no body yep. language expert, but Gigi and the champ don't look too happy about this. You've never heard of wedding jitters, Cole? Everyone's a critic. Ladies and gentlemen, we are gathered here today to celebrate the beauty of love. Yep. Lifelong commitment. <clears throat> Where's brother love when you need him? Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Really love and commitment? They're just jealous. Uh. Before we recite the vows, does anyone here have reason to object to this wedding? Speak now or forever hold your peace. You get the sense the WWE Universe is rooting for an interruption here. Uh, Troy. Aren't you skipping a couple of things? Isn't there the uh, ceremonial... The, the tying of our hands thing with the ribbons. We still need to do that. Uh, of course. Of course, of course, of course. Okay. First off. First off. Why is Becky Lynch coming out in a fucking suit? Real talk. The most Becky and Seth Rollins thing ever. Right. Let's go, preacher man. Get to the vows. I will kiss my groom. <laughs> okay. It was not. Oh uh, yeah. Oh uh, yeah. You are not gonna spoil my TV wedding. Ooh. She's not going to be upstaged. No, no, no. Here we go. All so hell is broken oh. loose. Come oh, on, Troy. now they're going to start throwing hands. Dang. Not the expensive flowers. So much for a calm and peaceful ceremony. The WWE I love how the I love how the guys just like. It's a war of the bride. And the grooms, too. We have lost all control yep. here. Into the wedding bower. Yup. Uh, the. <laughs> What in the world? Go to commercial, bro. <laughs> where, where's where? Where? First off, where was the security? Where was the extra reps? Where was the locker room at, bro? Like where? Where were they at in the presence of that madness going on? <laughs> Jeez, Louise. Ah. <clears throat> <sighs> Uh. Dang. All right. Well, um, let's talk to Gigi. See what she has to say, bro. This feels <clears throat> weird in my mouth to say, but thanks. I'm gonna mark today in my calendar. Gigi said thank you. Stop, or I'll take it back. Putting the WWE Universal Championship on the line to get me a title shot at Mania is kind of a big deal. I appreciate it. We're partners in crime, right? And nearly married co-hosts. You yep. really dodged a bullet there. Or actually, more like a missile. True. Come on, it wouldn't have been that bad. I guess. At least my phone wouldn't be getting blown up by Miz right now. I don't think he cares about the wedding going off the rails. <clears throat> He's more upset uh, to business for ourselves with these mania matches. Can I yeah. guess we better win? I'm a champion, and you're about to... Well, I'm just going to have to beat Becky Lynch in the middle of that ring. 
Facts. WrestleMania is over, we'll be the most powerful duo in WWE. I like the sound of that. All right. Well, um, I feel like this is a good point to end the episode on. Um, I'm going to have to figure out my gear for <laughs> rest for this WrestleMania. And yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, let me know in the comment section down below. Subscribe if you're brand new. And yeah, I will see you on another video. I am out. Also, sorry for my camera freezing. <laughs>